Hey, today we're at um, Mandalau, just out of Luang Prabang, and we're about to have an elephant encounter. And But first of all, we're going to talk to Mr. Prasop, and he's going to tell us whether he likes elephants or not. <laughs> so, but uh, it's, very, it's very easy to fall in love with elephants, but uh, for me that they have have something uh, between human and elephants. We all have a very big similarity, but sometimes we don't really, really uh, know it, but we perceive it inside. Yes. We have the same uh, the brain system as elephants. When you say that uh, we are the in intelligent animals, I think they have other kind of animals the same, and elephant is one of them. When we were born, we have 20% of the, 27% of the brain that big. But we get to fly out in the front of and elephant almost the same. They have thirty five percent they have to stand up. So we have almost the same ability to learn. Seventy percent. Right. But one thing that happened is better than us you kept they never stop growing. They keep on growing from the day they was born until they die, especially the brain. Oh. So I don't know if the elephant they have some school like us. <laughs> they maybe sit beside you in your at, uh, your office, I don't know. <laughs> so with this, um, but, uh, yeah, we walk the same speeds as uh, an elephant. You are very peaceful when you walk with the people that, uh, that you walk hand in hand with your friend because you walk in the same rhythm. Mm. We walk four kilometers per hour. We have the, the we are the language as animal the same, let's say, like uh, elephants. Elephants, they are no, they have special language that transfer emotion. They know yeah. that who they are. They know that if I am the elephant, I know that I am, I am the Abu named Prasop. And, uh, yeah, and uh, because when you know you are existing, you know you have the different uh, interactive with, you know everybody existing. Yeah, so they're spiritually aware. Yeah, and this is bring to a special emotion uh, uh, that's just like sympathy, sense of humor, and some others uh, just like, um, yeah, uh, a little bit play with the language, something, yeah. But with this, you know, uh, I think uh, this is uh, the general, but uh, for Lao, because I have, even I'm from Thailand, but I speak Lao, so I'm very, very, I'm very, very, very happy here. Speak so Lao is sticky rice, get into the Lao food. In Lao and the same as Thailand, we, we do believe that uh, at least we have chance to reborn or already born to be elephant at one past life. Because uh, you know, you know, this this is something something that uh, why the Lao people they are very very uh, a respect of the, some elephants. Because we believe they are um, in some Buddhism, they believe in life after death, yes. and we believe that uh, to reborn, the the highest condition of uh, the hu the all of the creature is not the human, even you are the angel, but the highest uh, condition is to be enlightenment, yes. and to be enlightenment you have to reborn to be human, human. but though. I'm quite sure because when you walk down from heaven, you want to reborn to be human, and then you slip, you wake up, you will find that you have really long trunk, <laughs> very big ear. <laughs> so to reborn to be human in an elephant is very yeah. similar. The Lord of Buddha used to be elephant before. Mm -hmm. Many many people that uh, I found that they had like the greatest serpent. It used to be the elephant before. So loud people. Please. Love people, they they have a very deeply belief that the elephant is very close. So they that they provide a lot of uh, 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 feeding ground for elephant. In Lao, they, we have what we call the public land for animals that that also welcome for the elephants. 